Hi everyone, here is Gul Trip. I am Burajan. Today we are in Çorum, Turkey to see how first power line communication aka PLC works. In this project, total installed PV power is 3 MW and 48 pieces of GW60K MT inverters has been used. For monitoring, we used SCB2000 box, which is for communication without any data cable like RS485. In this power plant, we use PLC communication method. With this method, we need one SCB2000 box. Let's see what's inside of the SCB2000. Here, the AC cable comes from the low voltage side of the transformer. And this AC cable directly comes to the PLC board. And this PLC board connected with our Easy Logger Pro. For power up this box, we need 220 volt cables. And this box also need the router and here our router you can see we get the internet connection with this box here we have 220 volt AC cables for powering up the box and for internet connection here the easy loggers connection side and this cable comes to our router here and to getting internet, we have this device. So this device gets the internet and we have a LAN cable. We can see historical and real-time data with mobile lab and SAMS portal website. Here we can see the overview of plan at the main dashboard. I already mentioned that we don't use any data cable for monitoring thanks to SCB2000. But what would happen if we didn't use SCB2000 communication method? First of all, for this 3 MW project, we would have to purchase at least 2000 meters of RS-485 cable plus accessories like a corrugated pipe for underground cabling and also extra labor costs would be added. Installation costs would higher at bigger projects. In the future there is a risk to loss of connection because of damage and abrasion. And also data cable requires maintenance time to time which would make another cost in the future. But we saved all these costs by choosing SCB2000. Thank you for watching us and see you in the next video.